a dance to celebrate the first harvest of what these people describe as the golden grain of the Andes. Quinoa has grown here in Bolivia for thousands of years, and it's been a staple part of indigenous people's diet. We have come here to harvest the quinoa, which is better than other foods, this woman says. And she's right about its nutritional value. This grain-like plant, which is related to beets and spinach, is high in protein and fibre. It's been described as a superfood by the United Nations and has become popular in Europe, the US and Asia. The government here is now working on boosting production. In the next 10 years, we want to cultivate 1 million hectares to produce a million tonnes of quinoa, because that harvest will allow us to generate $1 billion for the country. Bolivia produces most of the world's quinoa, and producers here have been offered financial incentives by the government to increase their yields. And it's been working. While the country had produced 30 million tonnes of it in 2011, that figure had risen to 50 million tonnes last year, 26 million tonnes of which were exported abroad. Rising demand abroad, though, has meant higher prices at home, which has led many families in Bolivia to start growing their own. But the UN thinks that these seeds, which are resilient to droughts and poor soil, could be the answer to the world's food security. Susanna Mendonca, BBC News.